Hi, this is uh, Ate from um, BorderWork.com. We're here with Karen uh, from uh, Body Media. And uh, we're here at the booth and we just wanted to find out more about uh, Body Fit and you know, the product and just give us your perspective on it. Um, okay, well, um, Body Media, the company, has been around since 1999. Um, we were created originally to create body monitoring devices that were used in the medical field. Yes. Um, in 2008, we actually expanded into consumer products as well. Mm -hmm. um, we currently offer two consumer products. Um, one of them, both of them are armbands. These are armbands that you wear on your left, uh, your left tricep. Left. Virtually 24 hours a day. We always like to say 23 hours a day. <laughs> give, your, give your arm a little bit of a rest. But um, since you're wearing it all day long, um, this this armband has some sensors on the back of it, and it's actually pulling about 5,000 data points per minute. And the sensors are measuring things like there's a three-axis accelerometer, measures your temperature, temperature fluctuations, and galvanic skin response. All that raw data is put into an algorithm, and, um, and we know from lots of validated clinicals that our armbands can accurately predict your um, caloric burn um, the only device that can do so at the same level of accuracy as one can find in a laboratory. Okay. We offer, um, by the way, since you're wearing the product 24 hours a day, not only can it capture automatically your caloric burn, it can also capture the quality and quantity of your sleep too. Okay. Um, now, for, that's from an automatic standpoint. Um, for both of our products, you have the ability to USB it and to um, upload it into a computer. Once it's in the computer, you also can log your food. So if you think about it, the food is your calories in, um, the calories out is already automatically captured, so you're able to, um, to manage your fitness level. You can also use it to lose weight. We have two different versions, as I said before. One that only works with the computer, and this version that was just launched right before the holidays, that um, that syncs with your um, with your smartphone and it is Bluetooth. -y. That's very nice. So, um, with the smartphone link, um, that allows you to basically. Uh, um, on the fly, put in your, your calorie intake. And I mean, like definitely that. from a food logging standpoint, that's so important, right? Because how many people forget what they eat by yeah. the time they sit down at a computer or they open a notebook? So the fact that you can carry it around and you can log as you're eating is really, really important. In fact, um, we, we thought it was so important, we created an app even for the original version so you can, you can food log even with the original version on your smartphone. But, um, but in addition to that, in addition to the food logging, I mean, think about it. You go into a coffee shop, right? And it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, you could look at the app and you could see precisely at that point in the day how many calories have you burned, how much have you consumed, and it could help you make a decision, you know, is it a cafe mocha right now or is it just a black coffee? So, you know, it will allow people to make decisions throughout the day to improve their health. Now, a question on the app with food logins. Um, I know, you know, it's not every day you have to say, uh, a specific type of meal. What about people who who cook, you know, say, you know, foreign meals or from, say, an Italian dish that has different things? Well, definitely, you know. um, one of the nice things about our food logging system, because I cook a lot of my own and uh, have my own special recipes, and um, I find that it's really, really easy to put those recipes in, and okay. then they're there forever. All right. You know, so so it's it has a nice feature where you can put in customized foods, okay. and then because you put them in, it's saved in a special log of favorite foods, and it comes up soon. You know, like whenever you're you're doing a search, those foods come up first. You know, the system doesn't do that yet. You know, like we don't we don't give you, you know, precise like, gee, you should do this, you know, gee, you should consider doing that. Um, I see that that might be in the future for it. 
right now we just objectively are giving you the data. It's up to you to decide what you want to do. I guess another, I think one of the reasons they've done it that way is, you know, some people, if they find that they are, let's say, consuming more calories than they're burning, there's two ways you could do that. You can reduce the number of calories you're eating or you can increase your activity level. Yeah. So, you know, we're actually giving people the flexibility deciding how to solve the equation. Now, how much does the unit uh, retail for? Um, the original, original version, version yeah. the original version's retail price is one ninety nine. Yeah. Although it's often discounted, uh, you can get it basically between one hundred and fifty and about one hundred ninety nine dollars. Um, and the Bluetooth version that was just introduced right before the holidays retails for two forty nine. Okay, um, the app's free um, for for both users. We do have a subscription above and beyond the purchase of the arm band. The purchase of the arm band always includes a trial subscription, which is no less than three months, but could be up to 12 months, depending on where you buy it and what kind of promotion is going on. Once that free trial period's over, there is a subscription that can range depending on how long you're going to commit to. If you commit to a year, it's six ninety five a month. If you want to do it month to month, it's twelve ninety five a month. Okay. But the reason we have the subscriptions, you know, our original one was introduced back in um, back in two thousand and eight, and with the subscriptions, instead of people having a lot of times with technology, you have to change it every twelve months or every eighteen months because there's something different, more features. We're actually building the features in through the subscription. Okay. So we're constantly getting more, more features from the software standpoint, and, and then obviously doing things like confirming the algorithms that they're as accurate as possible, and, and you know just making the whole experience better for people. Okay. Makes sense. Now, uh, one more question. I know this is more future thinking, let's see where it'll go. Since you guys have moved to the uh, mobile space with the right. apps, have you also, are you guys looking into um, all the avenues, say for instance, you know, gaming and, and things like that, where the Amban, you know, adds a lot of activity to that. Yeah, definitely. If you think about, you know, the calories burned that are automatically being pulled off, it's almost like currency. Yes. How could you how could you play with that currency? You really should come back tomorrow. We actually have a, a partner who's already started doing that, you know, taking our data and, and thinking about ways to create gaming. Yeah. So we're already working with some different companies to, to think about, you know, the whole edutainment part and gaming part of this. Okay. Thank you very much. Sure.